Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a holiday get ready with me because I have been so inspired by the Guerlain holiday collection. I love the tones, the colours and oh, they've just been shades that I've been wearing a lot recently and I thought why don't I sit down and create a video. So this year Guerlain have brought out the Guerlain Golden Land collection. This is some of the outer packaging but the inner packaging I mean this isn't a clutch bag by the way this is the eyeshadow palette everything has just got touches of like Grecian gold it's very luxurious and the colors inside are even more beautiful this is the palette as you open it up I love the mirror inside I love these tones you've got a mixture of mattes and shimmers and mattes right now I've really been loving because I've been going more like glossy on the lips and I think paired with a matte eye just looks amazing we've got these pearls here the meteorites that I absolutely love I've had a few of these from different collections like their summer collection and last year's winter collection and these just have like a beautiful different tone to them and I've just dropped one. Um, and even the matching lipsticks just look beautiful. Um, something that I've been really excited about, which isn't part of the holiday collection, so you can get this all year round, is that they now have a primer and a face mist, which are absolutely amazing. So this is the Lore. I think that's how you pronounce it, L-O-R. This has hints of real like 18 karat gold in here it has an amazing texture against the skin and it's just it gives you such a great base to put on a um lovely foundation and i've used the Guerlain l essential foundation which is amazing this actually helps to improve the texture of, of your skin over time so these two together are just amazing the smell is gorgeous and because it has the pigments of gold it just gives you that natural looking glow as you can see already on my skin it just kind of like shines through and that's what you want on the party season is to be looking very luminous and gorgeous and glowy so yeah so that so this is what I've used as my base and I applied it with my Guerlain face brush this has I think it's their kabuki brush but it's also self hygienic something like that i think like the charcoal in here it's a charcoal it's actually black because i've used it it's brown um so it's like self-cleansing but obviously you should still like clean your brushes and you can also use this in skincare this is great to pop in your handbag as well because it has the lid and um it just makes sure that nothing else is going to get onto your brush and i'm going to go straight in with this golden land palette i'm so excited to try this this is probably a better indication of what the colors you get inside so you get 10 shades here i believe you get five matte and then five shimmers and what i really really love is the green so i think i'm gonna do like a green smoky eye a lot of you might think really green but honestly it's such a huge trend this season so I am going to just get a flat angled brush. I'm just going to take this matte brown. It's like a taupey brown shade. And I'm going to use that on the crease of my eye. And again, I can't stop raving about this mirror because I just think it's so handy. And I'm just going to put that in like the socket of my eye. This is going to help blend it all in. So pop that in there. And a blending brush these colors are so gorgeous and the formula is so blendable and wearable There we go. Also, I have to quickly mention because I totally forgot. This palette also comes with two makeup brushes in here, which I think is so good if you're going away for the holidays and you just take this palette and you forget your makeup brushes. I've tried these before in a previous Christmas collection um, palette that they did, and the brushes that come inside are actually really, really good. I'm just going to take another makeup brush. This is another flat, um, what is it called? Like a just a flat tapered brush does that make sense but 
that's what I'm using. And I'm just going to take this green shade that I am so excited to try. And I'm literally just going to pat it all over the socket of my eye like this. How pretty is that? So this isn't like an in your face kind of green. It is more of a subtle, sophisticated, elegant green. Um, it's definitely wearable. And it's very demure, I think. It's not like an in your face, bright emerald green. Which can be very hard to pull off actually. Now, I actually went to a makeup masterclass with um, Galan and I tested this out and honestly, I feel like it just makes my eyes look even browner and more hazel. So, I've just patted that all along my eyeball socket, like so, and then I'm just going to blend that out again, just the edges, just so it blends in with the colour that we put in on our crease. So I've just zoomed you guys in so you can see how the green looks and there's virtually like no fallout as well. Like the pigments that Guerlain create in their eyeshadows are just oh, so nice, true to colour as well. Um, and yeah, they're not like very bitty if that makes sense. Um, so I'm just taking that same colour on the same brush and I'm going to do under my eyes. Now this is so lovely to do because it really does help open up the eye. I'm also blending this into like my eyelashes as well and then just blend that slightly i'm just going to now go in with a black eyeliner pencil and just line my waterline something i cannot do on camera unfortunately i don't know why and you can see how the look is slowly coming together now that i've got eyeliner on so i've just done the lower lash line and then the top and then i just done a little bit um, across my top lashes um, going back to this palette because it is the festive season I'm just going to take a more thinner flat brush and then I'm just going to go in with this khaki gold colour here and basically I'm just going to get the flat brush and I'm only going to put it on the middle part of my eye like so and just kind of dab it a little bit there is another gold in here and I would say this has got more green to it. I'm just going to pat it in there. And you can just see how it's kind of like created this ombre effect. So it's not just like a flat bit of colour. This under the lights is going to look so pretty. And there we go. Now just going to put on some mascara unfortunately i don't have any galan mascaras and i tried this amazing one at their masterclass um but i can't remember the name of it so i'm just going to go in with a stila um mascara so now that my eyes have done i'm just going to go in with the meteorites before we're going to go in with a bronzer and like I said, oh, these are lovely. They've kind of got like all different colours. So I've got mixtures of bronze, gold, like a luminous colour, a dark red, which is this one, which I don't think you can see. Yep, you can see a little bit there. And it honestly really does give you this whole like multi-tonal glow that looks natural to your skin tone i'm gonna take this brush from la mer it's like a nice big fluffy brush and i honestly love just putting it right in there swirling it around and just brushing it all over my face to set the makeup dust off any like loose eyeshadow which i haven't had and it just makes me look like my skin has always been like this if you know what i mean just kind of see like that sheen to it and this really does help like the makeup not move anywhere so if you're on the dance floor this is really going to make sure that your foundation isn't like slippering all over the place and they smell so good they smell like palmer violet sweets that i used to have as a child like 
so so good and the packaging is beautiful so once you're finished with these do not throw the packaging away like you can use this as a really beautiful trinket box or you could put a candle in here and put it on your coffee table now in for some bronzer and i'm going in with my one of my favorite terracotta bronzers i'm wearing the shade light here and this is how it looks now oh, i have been using the guerlain terracotta bronzer since my early 20s since i could like i had my own job and i can afford to buy the makeup that i wanted it smells like a holiday and it really gives you a beautiful natural bronzy glow and honestly like a little bit goes such a long way i'm just using an angled brush just to get in there on my cheekbones and then the other side just tap it in there it's one of their iconic products in the galan range and it's been like an iconic product for very good reason so i'm just going to do my forehead cheeks bring it down to like the chin you can also just quickly do your neck a bit on the chin a bit on the nose just where like the sun would naturally hit you right and then blusher i'm going in with another girl and favorite of mine this is the two-tone blush and i have it in the shade natural pink it is a two-tone blush i love two-tone blushes because you just don't want like a flat piece of color with me especially in the holiday season it is all about a luminosity and really having that shine so this has a highlighter and a blush you can use them separately or together i personally love to use them together um i'm just gonna use this brush actually first and just get the highlighter shade and just do the tops of my cheeks like so and like a bit down the nose and then with the same brush i'm gonna swirl it all around get some of those pink tones and just concentrate it on the apples of my cheek i feel like this uh color pink it's so you can see the colour pink it is. It's a lot more cool. It's a lot more vibrant. Um, and if you're on olive skin tone, don't like stare away from a pink like this bubble, like Barbie pink. Because it is actually really lovely for the complexion. Um, I tend to in the winter times go for more this shade of pink. And then in the summer, I go for a more corally pink. But this with the green looks so nice. It gives you that natural pop of colour as if like how your cheeks would naturally look outside in the cold. It gives you that very rosy cheek look which i think is so lovely let's go on to lipsticks so the lipstick i have there are a few in the collection i think there's four shades but two new rogue g cases and if you've never had a rogue g lipstick before it basically looks like this it is dubbed the james bond of lipsticks and it really is just having that convenience of opening and then you have a mirror right inside and these are interchangeable so you can put whatever shade of lipstick you want in these cases so you can match it to your outfit to your mood however you want this is shade number 94 and it's a beautiful burgundy color and i'm just gonna first of all use the tip of it just to line my lips a bit And then just get my finger, just blend it out a bit. I really love that kind of natural, just being kissed kind of lip. Then I'm just going to colour the lips in just a little bit in the centre. Can you see how deep that goes? Oh my god. It is absolutely stunning. And then I'm just going to blend it. A little bit and then there you have it and i feel like this lip color looks so lovely with the green eyeshadow it's very christmas colors i just ah, oh, i'm very in the holiday spirit this year um and then to finish it all off i'm gonna use their gold guerlain face mist this is the first time guerlain have ever brought out a face mist and i'm very happy about that Whew, smells absolutely gorgeous this is great to refresh your makeup so pop it in your handbag to also set and i feel like now we have triple setted this makeup so this ain't going anywhere 
So that's it guys. I hope you loved this mini review slash first impressions of, of the Guerlain Golden Land holiday collection. It's absolutely stunning. So I hope you guys really like this green smoky eye look with this very plum red lip. Perfect for the holiday party season ahead. Products I will leave direct links down below so you can purchase it yourself before they go. This is a limited edition collection and it's something to hold on into your makeup kit. And Guerlain is one of those I iconic brands have been around for over 100 years so having a piece of history as well is something that i personally love don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah.